Hello traders, FS Percolenti here. Today is Thursday, March 28th, and I'm going to be analyzing the Aussie US dollar, starting on the monthly, working my way down to the one hour time frame for the full top down analysis. So with the Aussie dollar, I still think this looks like a big old ABC, most likely an ABC of Y, which means that it most likely will take out the high of wave X before it actually does make a bigger push to the downside. Taking it down to the weekly, I actually still think that this first push up is a one of C. I still think this is a wave two of C, and I still expect that it will go up eventually for a wave three, a wave four, and a wave five of wave C, which should be a wave C of wave Y. So we're taking it down to the daily time frame. Daily time frame, the market has been pretty sideways this week. We did have a little decent little move today. Most likely this is an A. Most likely this is a B. I still think most likely it is going to go down probably at least at a 78% for wave C before we really do get that bigger push to the upside. So taking it down to the 4 hour time frame. On the 4 hour time frame, definitely a nice push down today. It still looks like maybe it could make a push up, but I think the trend is down. I still think this is a 1, a 2, and and a wave three and our primary focus definitely should be looking for lower highs lower highs lower highs for entries to go short for the continuation of this downtrend so taking it right down to the one hour time frame on the one hour time frame I mean, it definitely did push down pretty hard. Yesterday, I was saying that it looks like this would be a wave B. It looks like it should be a wave A, B. And it looked like it should go up for a wave C. But I also said yesterday that the trend is down on all the higher time frames. And it may not even make that wave C. And it may just continue down, as it, which is exactly what it did. Made a really, really nice entry to go short. Unfortunately, it was in the Asian session when I was still sleeping. But very, very nice entry. Now, it does look like possibly it will go up. But I wouldn't really be too focused on the longs. I think this is a wave three of C on the higher time frames, and if that is the case, then really we should still continue to be focused on going sort at the end of pullbacks for the continuation of this downtrend. So don't forget to join my free Discord channel linked in the card up here above, and don't forget to check out my new website linked down here below. As always, thanks and happy trading.